Hi, Sean McCaffrey, employment coach, finding a great job today. The topic for this video is resume writing objective, or in other words, is it even necessary to write an objective on your resume? I mean, after all, it's pretty obvious what the objective is, right? It's to get the job. That's the end game. Well, if you are serious about writing an objective or not sure how to go about it correctly, I'm going to give you a couple tips to make things a little bit easier for you. First of all, the objective should only be two sentences max, and because you only have six to eight seconds really getting the, the attention of your intended audience, of that employer. Each one of those words in that two sentence structure has got to be used effectively. It's got to talk about your career objectives, how they fit in well with the company you're applying for, as well as your skills and value you're going to bring to the table to help this organization succeed and become more prosperous. If you're not sure how to go about doing that, there's other uh, uh, alternatives you can do you can use instead of the objective and that is a professional summary and this is more like four or five sentences a paragraph if you will that allows you a little bit more latitude talking about your career objectives talking about the value that you bring and how you've been successful in the past which is going to determine your success for the future and bringing value to the organization helping them get over the over the cost and make them successful long term so you got a couple different options either the objective or the professional summary. Personally, I like the professional summary better just because it kind of tells a story that you can weave in and it's not so, uh, you know, there's, there's not, a, a, with, the, with the summary, basically you've got more latitude. The, each word is not as critical than if you choose to go the route of having the objective. So again, you've only got six to eight seconds, very short window of time to get the attention of your intended audience if you're not sure if the objective is right for you, scrap it, go to the professional uh, summary. It allows you more opportunity to tell me more about yourself, your career objectives, and how you'd be a great fit for the organization. Again, Sean McCaffrey, Employment Coach, and good luck in your job hunt.